Hello guys, welcome to Boxing Blog Center, the home of Ninja Boxing. And like I always say, please, if you're new to this channel, make sure you click the like and of course the subscribe button right now and also go to the notification bell icon. Click it and select all subscribers of your manga and new exclusive video you will definitely be notified and to my ninja brothers and sisters out there now go to take big one make sure that this video share subscribe the more you share the video the more people they know about the channel sharing is caring and it help us discover more people out there especially for ninja and africa we want you know know about the sweet science we want to embrace them we want to make something out of out of their life really our youths you know i mean some of our youths who are extraordinary extremely talented but because they don't get the backing and don't get people see we will be say you will put them through they will lose hope and go the wrong path now let's get straight to it tyson the gypsy king or queen fury has of course horsed the unified everywhere king of the universe and also the only two-time unified everywhere ruler in the whole wide world anthony joshua to vacate is WBO title WBO belt forget Usyk and fight him in 2021. <laughs> I love in Japanese man. So according to Fury, <laughs> Joshua should vacate his WBO strap. Man, he said, I quote, rather than fight all these mandatory is God, I will say just vacate those belts and fight the fight everyone wants to see. I ain't running from you. I don't care about you. I will go through you like a knife through a bottle. Come and fight the big boy. Step up to the plate and get knocked out. Then fight all those easy guys. No disrespect to Olesna Usyk, great fighter, cruiserweight, a world uh, champion probably going to be every world champion if he fights Anthony Joshua but don't take my retirement check baby don't do it I said to Deontay Water years ago do not take my retirement fund do not fight Joshua he's mine he's my countryman I'm having him I'm breaking in but it didn't happen he got broke in by an unlikely suspect in Andrews it was what it, 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 it was what it was but they fight Usyk. But if they fight Usyk, if they fight Usyk, we beat Joshua. But I bet they don't fight because why would he fight Usyk and get ten percent of what he can make of the Gypsy King? Vacated. Let them boys fight for the vacant WBO belt. Whoever it is, Usyk and Joseph Parker, we are at the top of the game. We are in this boxing to fight the biggest fights out there. It's a boxing match. What's the worst that can happen? You can lose. Big deal. Bro, Tyson Fury is talking as if he's this monstrous guy, this knockout artist, this guy that can take you out and do all those damages to you. You know, like, like he just believe in himself, bro. At the same time, he's forgetting that the Unified Way King is the main man. You know what I mean? It did something to him some years ago, inspiring. If you forgot that already now I'm trying to have like see I see if maybe you know he's this knockout out this guy is a guy that can just go there and take you you beat your tail water or uh, what we all know water is one trick pony water is the Alberta for sure and Nigerian I don't forget that but water is not as skilled as Anthony Joshua we all know he only has that right hand we everybody knows that Joshua has just unveiled and on and, and, and showcased you know, the murderous uppercut and of course the double heavy killer wheel left hook. Fury, we all know, has a very weak uppercut, no doubt about it. We know that. If you're a boxer, you know that. Fury has it. Don't compare to the champ, the king. I understand that Fury is very skillful. You know what I mean? No doubt about that. He's skillful. He's very tricky. And he also plays on my game. Joshua will, should never vacate that WBO strap. 
and Usyk will not beat Anthony Joshua. That I can even bet on it. I can bet on it with my last saving because I believe Usyk is a good boxer, very talented, but he's not been in there with a king. He's not been in there with a guy that can take him out, that can really hurt him. Not Ga Joshua is not Gaziev. Joshua is not Maris British. Joshua left to one punch of Joshua can hold Usyk. Usyk, uh, we don't know how, how, how solid he, you know he's a uh, he's a uh, is. Is the fact we saw that Tony Bellew when he fought Tony Bellew, like Tony Bellew was within the bout until he gassed out and it's his round. And then Usyk then jumped on him and took him out. Joshua's that the, the, the punches that Tony Bellew was was landing, I was at boxing Usyk. Joshua can do double, triple, than that, and those punches are not going to be like soft punches. They're going to be deadly punches that can take you out. They can knock an elephant and a lion out at once. What's the take on uh, Tyson Fury statement, brother? Tyson Fury, Tyson the <laughs> you know what? But Tyson, he talks all this crap. I don't think he believes it himself. You know, I'm trying to figure out if. I'm, well, let me get let me let me straighten out Tyson Fury fans once and for all. Tyson Fury is never gonna put Joshua on his ass. The only way he puts Joshua on his ass if Joshua uh, becomes reckless and gets tired. That's it. Tyson Fury is not known to be a power puncher. If he did, he would have beat Otto Wilding. Guess what? He did. Okay. Um, with that being said, Tyson Fury, I don't think he believes that crap he even says half the time he talks. He just talks just to keep you, Tyson Fury fangirls, entertained. You know, it's just to keep some people entertained. Because if you think about it, Tyson Fury has to defend his belt against Deontay Wilder. And we all know what comes with Deontay Wilder, that powerful right hand of his. And I'm going to be honest, we don't know if it's going to land. If it does land, there's a likely chance Tyson Fury might go to sleep that he might not get back up. And there's a likely chance that if he does get back up, you know, it's going to land again. Or Tyson Fury is going to be, he's, he's going to be injured. So he knows if I lose that belt, I got to have a reason for AJ to drop those belts. So I got to make it known. Like, yeah, AJ, drop those belts and, you know. Come fight me. Why would AJ drop the belt that he's been working for? Why would he even drop the belt that he killed himself over for? He's not like you who vacated a belt because he lied. He got caught with drugs and it got swept under the drugs. I mean, under the, under the, under, under the rug. Yeah. People forgot that Tyson Fury got caught. You know, he tested positive for, for PEDs, performance enhancing drugs. And then he, 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 swept, he got swept under the rug and then he blamed it on depression, drinking, and coke all that crap be honest with yourselves you know these tyson fury fans they, they don't want to be honest with themselves when it comes to tyson fury tyson fury is has been on i i i has been lucky thus far to his career and he's gonna pay what's owed when he faces aj i'm telling you he's gonna pay what's he's gonna he's gonna pay what's being owed because he doesn't believe half the crap that he says sometimes talking about he's gonna put he's gonna run through AJ like a knife through butter when was that last time you ran through an opponent like AJ like knife through butter AJ and Wilder are two different opponents AJ is completely skilled all around power in both hands Wilder skilled one dimensional fighter power in one hand when AJ gets to you you're gonna crumble when AJ gets to that body of yours you're gonna crumble ever wonder why Tyson Fury weighs those his trunks all the way up because he doesn't want to get hit to the body. When 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 uh, when when um, Derek Chisora hit him to the body, do you know what Tyson Fury did? He complained to the ref and said, "Oh, he was hitting me low blow." No, he wasn't. Derek Chisora hit you to the body and then you complained to the ref. And that soft body of yours. Nobody's ever touched you up in that body. They always touched you up in the head. But don't worry. They're just going to touch that body of yours. And then the, and then what comes next is that head. You touch the body and the head falls. That's where I'm going to end it. Titans Butter. 
um, for your worldwide statement. I appreciate it. Now, guys, you heard it from Todd Jackman. What do you have to say? Like the video, share, subscribe, and go follow me on Instagram at uh, Boxing Block Center, on Twitter at Boxing Block, and on Facebook at Boxing Block Center. And I go that I take back when I make go follow me for Instagram. I want each one kid there. May I start one show? On, one start. Make Una go follow me for there. God bless you guys. Cheers.